Get Creative has just released a new device called Tag Zone that essentially lets you set up a space where one team can tag another team. And then you can decide what kind of behaviors take place after that tagging occurs. So this is what it looks like. I can set it up with a lot of different options. Right now I have this tag zone set up to be an actual zone, meaning that they have to be in this space where the green line is for the tagging to happen. Could, however, change it so that the tag area is the entire map. So I have that option. I can specify where I want the tagging to be able to take place, or I can make it the whole game, the whole map. You can see that I can control the distance between two players for what would be considered a tag, how close I want them to be before the tag happens. Um, if I want a player to be respawned after the tag happens, or if I just want it to um, the tag to be counted somewhere else, and I can control which team becomes the tagging team for that zone. I can make uh, something transmitted on a channel if a tag occurs or if someone else gets tagged. I can always activate and deactivate the tag zone based on different channel signals that I receive. I can decide whether it's available on game start and um, control its availability. So I have a set scenario set up here where in this tag zone um, I broadcast to this counter and I use this counter as kind of a, a go-between between the tag zone and the property because I can't update a property directly from a tag zone, meaning I can't say, okay, this property goes up one when I tag someone. So I use this, this counter as kind of a go-between that will update this tag score property. And then I have my leaderboard score set up to track that tag property. So I should be able to run this and every time my counter goes up, my leaderboard score should go up because it's tracking this tag score property. So let's try that out. So I have some people set up here and my zone is down here. Now I did run into kind of a bug where because everybody was starting at the same spot, I originally had my tag zone up here and the tagging just started happening automatically and continuously and I couldn't move off the spawner. So I had to move my tag zone down. If I go over to one of my bad guys, so I have uh, two different teammate or two different teams here. So when I get close enough, a tag should occur. And because this guy is on the team that's being tagged, not the tagging team, the um, other team score goes up, and I get respawned. Okay, so I've been tagged twice. That means that the leaderboard should reflect that because I used that counter as a go-between to update a property and I'm tracking that property as my score. Um, that score is going up every time a tag happens. So that's what a tag zone is and how you can use the tag zone to track your leaderboard or to control the score on your leaderboard.